Look, Jeff, sometimes with being overweight, it can actually reflect a deeper psychological problem. What's the problem? My legs are always aching. Maybe that's because you're a fucking hot air balloon. You don't need the hip replacement surgery anymore, okay? <laughs> that's great. Listen, bro, you're a write off. What does that mean? Basically, you're gonna cost more to fix than what you're worth. These guys got their doctorates through a government scholarship program for disadvantaged children. Gonna lift weights every day, I'm bulking. Bulking? You're fucking bulging, bro! You're useless, your whole front end is fucked up, it's all bent. Yeah. There's no amount of machinery that's gonna fix what you got. Like that head, man, I don't know. Like, oh, I'm having trouble looking at you. Some of the patients that have come out have told me horror stories. Get away! I hate you! I don't know what to do with her. I've seen three doctors already. Alright, I know exactly what to do. Leave her with me. Well, last doctor told me it was a thyroid problem. But it's not a thyroid problem, it's a fucking salami problem. Thank you so much. What did you do? How much Ritalin did you give her? I didn't give her Ritalin. I gave her a special remedy that's worked for over 3,000 years. Yeah. It's called the fucking headlock! My throat hurts and I think I have the cold. Okay, are you sexually active? What does that have to do with... Well, as a fucking doctor, I've got to ask these questions. So are you or not? <laughs> yes. Far. Uh, uh, should we be with him? So, my husband's not being intimate with me anymore. Okay, so how often do you nag him then? Kyle, it's everyone's right to have a child, and you've earned that right by overcoming your addiction. Yeah, what? Well, I want a baby, I want IVF! Bitch, you need a shower and a new set of teeth! Next time this happens, you gotta speak to your mummy and daddy, alright? You're getting bullied at school, huh? Who did it? Five. Fucking faggots, bro. You bro, fives, you fives are the worst. Next time you play footy, we'll give you some headgear so it won't happen again. Forget headgear. This is gear. This shit works every time. Have you had sex in the last seven days? Yes. Missionary or doggy? Listen, when I operate, if you start doing the little shits, I'm gonna fucking knock you out. Alright, if the drugs ain't working, I'm just gonna fucking elbow you. It's just easier for me, but I don't wanna deal with it. A man will only have sex once he's had a good meal. What are you making? I made him a bee strong enough last night. Yeah, yuck. No wonder he doesn't want it. But my fucking neck hurts. Listen, you're a crackhead. Do you understand? You're a fucking crackhead. You want more ice? I'll give you more ice. But I feel invisible. Like, no one notices me. I want you to understand, okay, that it's about loving yourself. You need bigger tits. Once I'm done with them, fuck, everyone's gonna notice you. Well, I came because I'm on the pill, but I want to know if I can take MDMA with it. I would not recommend that. Can I take MDMA or not? Can I take MDMA or not? Yeah, you can. Yeah, but you're Doc. still a dumb bitch if you do. Look, that's fucking stupid. Yeah, Look, you shouldn't be taking MDMA if you want to study and shit. If you want to study, you need coke and speed. If he refuses to have sex with you, get a drop of your period blood and dip it in his tea. His penis will be like a donkey's penis. My toenails are hurting as well and I'm breathing really funny. What's the problem? Oh, my neck, my back. You're pushy and you crack? Shut up, bitch. There's nothing wrong with you. You fucking psycho. First, you gotta put your neck into it. Don't stop. Just, Just do, do it, do it. Then you roll your tongue from the... Are you likely to continue to be sexually active? Well, yeah. When? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm here for the knee reconstruction. Bro, you need a fucking head reconstruction.